Welcome friends. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how you can group objects together and also ungroup them and even rotate them to whatever angle that you want. So I'll go to insert option here, then I'll go to shapes, then I'll bring out two objects. So I have my rectangle, I have my circle. Okay, let me add the third one. I have a square. So I have three objects here. So how do I select all these three objects? I could do Ctrl A or I click on the first one, press on my shift key, on my control key, click on the second one. While my control key is still pressed down, then I'll click on the third object. So the three objects have all been selected. Then if you go to page layout and you come right here, you see group. So you see the group button becomes activated. This group button will not be activated if you, are, you have only one system, only one object on the screen that is selected. Let me do that again. So if I take this one out and take this one out and I have only one object, you can see the group bot button is not there. But if I have more than one object, then the group button will automatically be activated and getting ready for me to use. So I'll click on the first one press down control key click on the second one and click on the third object so the group button is is activated here so i just need to click on group then group once i do that this becomes a single object so i can select it as one object and move it around i can also ungroup it by going to this and saying ungroup in this way all of them now will become distinct distinct object so that's how to group and ungroup an object so the next thing I'm going to do is I'll group them together. I'll group them together. Then I will now rotate them. So they are grouped as one. Then I'll go to rotate. Then I can rotate it the way I want. 90 degrees to the right, to the left, 90 to the left. Flip vertically, flip horizontally. Then you can do more rotation. So that's how this works. And of course, you can also align to whatever you want. Align to the left, center middle bottom and the system will take it down so wherever you want to align it place the alignment basically has to do with placing this in different positions the system will do that for you so but of course since they are grouped together you can always still drag it to wherever you want so that's how to use the group on group um, rotate and align commands in microsoft word thank you for listening